Refreshing Stories. My name is Hiroshi. I'm on the basketball team at Refreshing High School. Until middle school, I was what you might call a loser, and I loved reading manga. But my favorite of all of them was a basketball manga. Especially that legendary basketball manga I've read over and over again. I loved it so much that it made me want to play basketball. And when I joined the basketball team in high school, I discovered a hidden skill that exploded. Just by lifting up my left arm, I was able to score multiple baskets. It didn't take long for me to become the number one ace of the team. Our team played really well together, and we had a beautiful team manager and a passionate coach. With their support, I'm living a great life as a high school basketball player. Hiroshi, great job again today. Here, a special drink just for you. Oh, Akane, you made this just for me? Ah, it's delicious. Yo, Hiroshi, did you say special drink made by Akane? That's right, a special drink just for geniuses. Ah, you better not get carried away. We're stuck with sports drinks while you get Akane's specialty drink. Who do you think you are? <laughs> well, I guess that's the difference in skill. Damn it. Well, I guess you are the ace of the basketball team. But I also had Akane make me an Akane special rice ball the other day. What? But that's more amazing. Well, yeah. Although I bet you can't get one. Hey, come on, Yuta. I told you to keep that a secret. Why not? I was just letting him know that I'm the one that's one step in the lead. I also like Akane, so I'm not gonna lose. Huh? But you've never even had a girlfriend before. A guy like that would be a waste on Akane. I'm the one that's better suited for her. These two are my teammate Yuta and our beautiful team manager, Akane. Yuta is a basketball player from the core, and he always makes plays in good taste. With Yuta, we're always going against each other in basketball skill, but we're also both going after Akane, and he's my rival. Hey, Hiroshi! Do you have a minute? Yes, coach! You were getting around the court well again today. Keep it up. We're counting on you. You're a necessity on this team. If you keep playing basketball like this, you will definitely be able to go down the professional road. And I'm saying this after seeing many students over the years. I have no doubts. Thank you very much. I'm gonna work harder so that I can get stronger. And I'm definitely going to become a professional athlete. Interesting. Professional athlete, huh? A few days later, Akane called me out, and I met her behind the gymnasium. I'm sorry to call you out here out of nowhere. Listen, Hiroshi. Actually, I, I like you. What? Akane? You... You like me? Yeah, Hiroshi, will you go out with me? No way. I can't believe Akane is asking me out. It's almost too good to be true. But there's no reason for me to say no. I like you too, Akane. I can't wait to be your boyfriend. Yay! Me too, from now until forever. And so, I got my first ever girlfriend in my life. Everybody in the basketball team quickly found out about Akane and me. But apparently, she'd been handing out specialty items to everybody on the team. And suddenly... The whole team was full of sad, heartbroken guys. Yuta was one of those guys. Damn it. Can't believe I lost to Hiroshi not only in basketball, but in love, too. Akane, this is just part of a dare anyway, right? <laughs> I'm sorry, Yuta. I'm head over heels for Hiroshi. We even have a date set up for this weekend, okay? Hey, Akane! It's a little embarrassing. You don't have to stick to me like that. Damn it! How dare you show off like that! That weekend, Akane and I went on our first date. This was the first date of my life, so I was nervous the whole time. Wow, look at this! This purse is super cute! It is. I think it would suit you, Akane. Whoa, this costs $3,000? High school students these days carry things like this? Hey, Hiroshi, for my birthday, will you buy this purse for me? Uh, I'm not working a part-time job, and even if I saved up my allowance and my New Year's money, I don't know how many years it would take. Well, well... If I become a basketball player in the NBA, then I can buy you as much as you want. As if. There are plenty of purses over there, too. What? You mean at that general store? Yeah, yeah. And plus, it says they're having a sale. Maybe they might have something we can dig up over there. After that, in order to eat, we went to a diner. What? Why are we here? This is where we all come with everyone after practice. I really like this place. It's spacious, we can take our time, the menu is really big, and it's cheap and delicious. Yeah, but... I'm gonna go over to the drink bar. Do you want your orange juice as usual, Akane? Uh, sure. 
<sighs> this date is so boring. He won't even buy me a cute purse and we're at a diner. Even if we are in high school, Hiroshi is way too poor. But, well, I just have to put up with this for now. Once Hiroshi goes pro and starts earning money, we shouldn't have to go on any of these poor dates anymore anyway. Damn it, I guess I have no choice. Sorry to keep you waiting. Here you go. Y yeah, thanks. A few months later, after practice, the entire basketball team was gathered up, and the coach said that he had something really important to tell us. At the next practice game, apparently a scout from a professional team is coming to observe the match. For the player who's named MVP at this game, you can expect that they'll definitely be going pro. Hiroshi, you can't let this opportunity go. No matter what, do your best. You know it. Becoming a pro basketball player is my dream. I know you can do it, Hiroshi. But also, if you don't become a professional player, that will be an issue. What? Oh, nothing. Nothing at all. Well then, shall we go home? Damn, Akane. She's all over Hiroshi, and Hiroshi only. I'm gonna do my best to practice too. If I become the MVP player, I wonder if I can date Akane then. And then I'll become a pro athlete. And what if I end up marrying Akane? <laughs> if I get to marry Akane, that would be the best. Ah, I want Akane. In that case, I have to get MVP at that game. No matter what, I have to do this. I have to beat Hiroshi! And I'm going to become a professional basketball player! A few days later, the practice game we were all waiting for began. In the stands, the professional basketball scout was already viewing the game, so everyone was playing more aggressively than usual. The scout's actually here! But he keeps only looking at Hiroshi. If only he wasn't here, then they'd pay more attention to me. I have to do whatever it takes to get MVP today, and to make Akane like me! All right. I have no choice. I'm gonna send a ridiculous pass to Hiroshi and make him fall over. Hey, Hiroshi! I'm passing to you! Okay, Yuta! Wait, hey! Yuta threw a pass at me in unbelievable speed. I lunged to desperately try to get the ball, but I lost my balance, and I fell over at a weird angle. Ah! Time out! Time out! Ow! Uh, I'm sorry. I put a little bit too much power into that pass. Hmm. This is pretty swollen. Doesn't look good. I'm gonna take Hiroshi to the hospital. Yuta? You're in charge. Lead the team. Yes, coach! Hiroshi, you can leave the rest to me! Uh, Yuta, I'm counting on you. Hey, wait! Hiroshi is leaving the game! What about his professional career? After I was escorted out, Yuta led the team, and he was able to bring them to victory. And then, Yuta was crowned as the MVP. Thanks. I just spoke to the scout guy earlier, and he said that when I graduate, I can join the professional team. What? Seriously? In that case, it might be better for me to dump Hiroshi and switch over to Yuta. You see? If Hiroshi isn't around, this is how much I can do. And you know, if Hiroshi wasn't around, maybe right around now, I'd be dating you, Akane. And if only you'd be my girlfriend. Sure. What? You heard me. I can be your girlfriend for you. I'll be your girlfriend if you want. Wait, seriously? What are you gonna do about Hiroshi? I'm gonna break up with Hiroshi. More than the peasant Hiroshi, professional basketball player Yuta is perfect for me. I did it! This is exactly as planned! Thank you. I swear I'll make you the happiest girlfriend. Let's be together forever. Yuta. Blech. When I look at him up close, this guy really is so ugly. But this is for the money. This is a time to hold it in, Akane. On the other hand, after going to the hospital, I was given a shocking truth by the doctor. I fell in a really terrible way, and I was told that I wouldn't be able to play basketball ever again. No way. But it was my dream to become a professional basketball player. My life is over. On top of that, as if to rub salt in my wounds, bad news kept coming. When I got back from the hospital, I told Akane about my injury, but then... Oh, so you won't be able to be a professional player anymore. Well then, let's break up. What? But why? Because if you're not going to become a professional player, then there's no point in dating you anyway. But I don't want to quit basketball either! But the doctor told you that it wouldn't be possible, right? In that case, I don't need you anymore. That's awful, but I like you, Akane, from the bottom of my heart. That's none of my business. <laughs> oh, and by the way, I decided to go out with Yuta. Yuta's going to become a professional basketball player, and I'm going to live a life where I never have to worry about money. Hey, Akane, are you done talking to Hiroshi yet? Yuta, sorry to keep you waiting. It's already done with Hiroshi. You can't play basketball anymore. How cold-hearted are you, even though I'm injured and suffering? You're so annoying. Yuta, let's hurry up and go. Goodbye, Hiroshi. Well, Hiroshi, that's that. So see you. 
Hey, Akane! Yuta! Damn it, those two! Wait a minute, did Yuta set me up? Five years later, Yuta became a professional basketball player and married Akane. You might think that Akane was living the rich life that she dreamed of, but that wasn't quite the case. Yuta wasn't doing so well in his games, and his contract wasn't that high either. A very different reality from Akane's ideals was waiting for her. Hey Yuta, that brand name purse I asked you for last time, you still haven't gotten it? And I still haven't gotten to go to America. What is going on here? There's nothing I can do about it. The season hasn't been going that well. There is something you can do about. You need to try harder. I'll do better next time. Please, can you cheer up a little bit, my sweet Akane? Stop it! Don't touch me! No! What? Wait, what is this? Is this a joke? Ouch! Is that the TV? What is it? $50 million contract Japanese NBA player Hiroshi Ohira in top form? Wait, wait, what the heck is this? That Hiroshi in the NBA, what is going on? Didn't he say that he wouldn't be able to play basketball anymore? The two of them were seeing a news channel reporting on my success. To their surprise, I'd become an NBA player. Five years ago, uh, I can't play basketball anymore, and I lost my girlfriend that I loved. What am I supposed to do now? Hey, Hiroshi! What's the matter? Why the long face? Coach, I was told that I can't play basketball anymore. Even after you told me that I would be able to become a professional player, I can't believe that this is what happened. It's true. The injury was unfortunate. But are you just going to give up like that? What? But my leg won't move the way that I want it to. Hiroshi, the most important thing is your mindset. Sure, you can quit basketball and choose to start a new life. However, if you give up now, will you have any regrets? The moment you give up, then it's game over. This is your life, and you have the power to decide. Coach, I... I want to play basketball! I was waiting for those words. Hiroshi, I'll support you, because you are my precious student and athlete, after all. Coach! From there, I got back on my feet. I used the devastation of the injury after being dumped by my girlfriend as my motivation and felt like I was reborn as I dove into physical therapy every day. And then, my injury miraculously started to heal, and I was able to start playing basketball again. I didn't want to go back to the basketball team where Yuta and Akane were, but thanks to the coach's introduction, I started practicing with the local college team. By practicing with people older and stronger than me, my skills exploded even more, and I was given a scholarship from a college. After that, I became the ace within the college leagues. And while I was still in college, I was scouted by the NBA and crossed over to the United States. And even as a Japanese player, I was able to join the top players in the league. And finally, I'd become a superstar with an annual contract and $50 million. I can't believe that poor Hiroshi now has a $50 million contract. If only I hadn't broken up with him back in high school, I could have been a celebrity by now. Well, maybe it's still not too late. Even after we broke up, Hiroshi was still dragging it on, so once he sees my face, I'm sure he'll want to get back together. Let me try messaging him now. Phew. That was another tough practice today. Oh, I have a DM in my Instagram. What? Akane? What is this? I want to see you, Hiroshi. So I'm thinking of coming to the US? Huh? She's coming here? I couldn't ignore this, but she did go out of her way to message me, so I guess I can reply. There's no way she would come to America anyway. Oh, I got a reply from Hiroshi. If the opportunity arises, let's meet. Yeah. Aha! Uh -huh. This definitely means that he still likes me. I knew it. Hiroshi, you're so easy. So anyway, that means that Akane has won 50 million. The diplomatic reply that I had loosely given to Akane, she completely misinterpreted. But she took it and ran. And she left her husband, Yuta, a farewell letter and divorce papers and came over to the United States. Thinking she was going to get married to me, Akane was fully in celeb mode. So she flew first class and booked a five-star luxury hotel. She went on a brand name shopping spree and enjoyed a full course meal at a high-end restaurant. The fact that she could do all of this based off of an assumption was almost impressive in a way. Oh, there he is. Hey, Hiroshi. Akane? You seriously came all the way to America? Yeah, when I saw you on TV in Japan, I was reminded of our high school days. It made me want to come see you. Interesting. So? You know, 
I always believed that you would definitely succeed in the future, and it made me think that I wanted to support you up close by getting married to the professional basketball player Hiroshi. So, will you take me as your wife? Sorry, I haven't seen you in years, and you're all of a sudden approaching me with a proposal? Wait, what? Is this a prank? It's not a prank, I'm being serious. I love you, Hiroshi. Listen, how many years ago are you talking about? And now you're saying you love me? Because you gave me a reply. If the opportunity arises, let's meet. That means that you're willing to start over with me, right? That's why I rushed here to come see you. No, that was just a diplomatic response. We're not in high school anymore, you know. Besides, I didn't think you would actually come all the way to America. You liar! I know that you still like me, Hiroshi, and you get to get married to someone as cute as me. You should be grateful. No, no way. The moment you found out that I was injured and I wouldn't be able to play basketball, you dumped me and ran away with Yuta. And then you went all the way and got married, right? Well, that was youthful indiscretion, as they call it. But I'm going to break up with Yuta anyway. So you're going to dump Yuta like you dumped me back then? You're seriously the worst. I'll apologize for what I did back then. That was really awful of me. I'm sorry, please forgive me already. No, you don't need to apologize for back then. If anything, I'm grateful to you. After you dumped me, it became the best motivation for me to bounce back. Thanks to that, I'm still able to play basketball now. And not only that, but I get to play in the NBA. The best! That's why I'm grateful to you, Akane. And plus, back then, I wasn't able to take you on any good dates. My bad. What? If you're grateful, then that means you still have feelings for me, right? In that case, let's start over starting today. Remember you said that when you became an NBA player, you would buy me anything I want? How is that the conclusion? Of course that's not happening. I did say that if I became an NBA player, but there's no way I'm going to start over with you. N no way! Well then, the flight ticket and the hotel expenses and all the brand name things that I bought, what am I supposed to do about paying for those? What are you talking about? I was planning on marrying 50 million Hiroshi, so I left my house and my husband everything back in Japan. If I married 50 million, I wouldn't have to worry about money anymore. So when I landed in America, I treated myself a lot. Well, that's none of my business. Hey, Akane! What? Yuta? What are you doing here? What do you mean? I came chasing after you, Akane! You left divorce papers and a letter out of nowhere and disappeared! What's going on here? Wait, Hiroshi? Is that you? Hello. Long time no see. After you made fun of me in high school, how sad that you're also getting dumped by Akane. Even though you were able to get MVP at that game and become a professional player as you wished. Shut up, Hiroshi! More importantly than that, how dare you steal Akane! Just because you have money doesn't mean you can do whatever you want! No, I haven't done anything. Your wife made up her own misunderstanding and came all the way to America on her own. Not only that, but on first class nonetheless. Please, can you hurry up and take her with you? I need to get back to practice now, too. What? First class? Akane, what's he talking about? But also, what are those clothes? And what's that bag? They're all expensive luxury goods! Uh, I'm so sorry. After that, after Akane selfishly flew out of Japan and spent money left and right as she wished, Yuta dragged her back to Japan. The amount of money that Akane spent was more than what Yuta would be able to pay, even as a professional basketball player. And so, they were forced to take out a very big loan, and are apparently paying it back to this day. If I continued dating Akane from high school, to think that I could have ended up the same way as Yuta is a terrifying thought. No matter what happens, I'm going to continue playing this sport that I love, because I'm a genius after all. <laughs> Thank you for watching all the way till the end. Don't forget to subscribe and smash that like button. And if you have time, please check out our other videos as well. Alright then, see you next time. Bye!